Hi everyone, I'm back to continue the jewelry and I did purchase some new things. So uh, let's see what we have. Let me just get closer. Give me a second, guys. Why am I so far, far away? Okay, uh, I think this one is the zoom, right? Is it? No. Oh, there we go. Okay, perfect. Okay, guys, uh, so I did uh, take these to the jeweler and he did say that they're real Tiffany. And uh, the ring is a size six and oh, it's between six and six and a quarter. So it's just a little over six. I still didn't get a chance to clean them. And let me see what else I wanted to show. Oh, yes, I did detangle these uh, necklaces. This was one. And this was the other one. Okay. And I don't know what's on my desk here. <laughs> clean it up okay and and i didn't get a chance to use the cleaner yet so i haven't cleaned anything okay uh this one is a damascene uh bracelet with birds uh you can see it has a little bit of wear well not a little bit it was obviously loved so it does have some wear but it's still uh beautiful it just needs some polishing we have that i still have to go through the box please. I still haven't gotten through it. So, but I did pick some stuff out of it that I was able to see. Uh, this one here, it's a beautiful vintage rosary. Look how beautiful that is. Uh, I don't think this is, this is silver or anything. And this is how it looks. It's very pretty. And we have that. This is just a, a regular ball necklace and the rest will still go through this one over here uh, it is marked 925 but i have not tested it yet look at this it's an hourglass and i think i see mark on here <laughs> let me check yes it says 925 and then um there's some kind of hallmark on it that looks kind of like a clover but it's so cute hourglass there's some clovers on here oh there's an evil eye over there and yeah i just need to test this one so a lot of fun charms i love that charm okay next oh there's an alpaca beautiful usually i see alpaca with uh mother of pearl or um some type of like um in, inlay but this one seems to be a purple i'm not sure if that's a stone or if it's uh, a some type of enameling very cute this is, i like this bracelet too and then we had this one is a glass bead necklace with a vintage clasp have that one and then I'll show you the new items that I got. And oh, these. I hadn't, I don't think I opened these yet. Did I? No. Okay, let's open these then. Um, this one. Okay, it just says Korea. So it's not silver or gold filled. But we did find one that was gold filled, remember? Okay, and then this one. Um, yeah, I think this one is the same as this. Okay. We'll put these in crafts. Okay. Now let me show you the new stuff that I got. Okay. Look how pretty this is, guys. It's a jewelry box by Andy Warhol. And I bought, there was some jewelry in there too. I'll show you the jewelry. But I think it's so beautiful. It's Mickey Mouse. It does have, um, let's see here somewhere in here over here. this corner has a little bit of wear but it's pretty old so even with that i love it i love that it has the little wooden feet it's a music box that plays music and let's see what we have inside okay this one guys look how pretty this is it's a hair barrette and i was looking and looking and looking <laughs> And I did notice there's a mark over here on, on this corner. 
and it's actually a Kirk Foley's. Isn't that amazing? Very, very pretty. Who, who would have thought? <laughs> I didn't even know uh, Kirk Foley made, uh, made hair barrettes or any kind of hair jewelry. Okay, next I have this one here. Look at this, guys. This one is a, I don't know if this is silver or alpaca. My guess is it's alpaca. Look at, it's, I think it's for hair. Look how old that is. It's a beautiful alpaca hair piece over here. Um, my guess is that this is alpaca and not silver. Sometimes these will be silver and they have the same kind of, you know, design on it and inlay on it and they are sterling and they will say sterling. But my guess is this one is an alpaca and it does have the beautiful abalone. Okay, next we have this one here. Look how cute this is. It's sterling silver. It's a terrier dog. This is the back. Uh, it is marked. It's adorable. <laughs> it's too cute. And then we have these earrings that are sterling and copper. Isn't that cool? Look at this. There's some uh, designs over here. It's a dangle earring with sterling silver, and then it has this part is copper. Yeah, it's very interesting. So, this one. And we have this one here. This is also sterling silver. It's a cowboy boot. And it's a pin. I have that. And this one here, guys, it's a garnet. It's a one long strand of garnet, beaded garnets. Um, I think that the, the necklace it's on, it's sterling findings. I need to test this one. Uh, my guess is that it is on sterling, but look how beautiful they are. It's a nice long strand. You can double this and it would be a wonderful layering piece. So we have that and we have a few other things. Okay, we have this one is a Brighton. Here's the little B and there's a little flower there and this one is on a toggle clasp i had never seen a brighton on a toggle and it has three hearts on here as charms here they are and there's i think inspirational quotes in the back it says passion hold on let me see if i can read it gratitude and embrace life so we have that next i have a 1928 necklace with bezel black crystals here and then i have this vintage brooch with blue rhinestones and this Christmas tree. Look how cute that cabochon in the center is. Oh, <laughs> we have that one. And this one is my favorite. Look at this, guys. I really got lucky with this one. It's a beautiful vermeil. Um, garnets. Look at those garnets. Huge beautiful and look at the side how it's made isn't that beautiful i want to see if i can zoom into this one i mean be able to see look at that it's just beautiful the most beautiful ring i've ever seen the garnet ring i mean oh my gosh so this one i think was a size seven and I did look at these, but not, not the box. We're going to go through the box. This one is a size 7, just a little over 7. It is so, so pretty. Oh, my gosh. I love this. <laughs> I am in love with this one. So pretty. And the box and the ring. Oh, my gosh. 
so pretty. I love it. And let me see if it says what the song that it's playing. Uh, Andy C. It says Andy Warhol. And it says 1928 to 1987. Double Mickey Mouse, 19, is that 81? Screen print. Um, and then it says 1995, visual arts. Uh, Linden tune is When You Wish Upon a Star. Oh my God, I love that. I love that. Very cool. And it works. It's just beautiful. So these are my favorites right now. <laughs> this, I love this. I love this. It's a sterling vermeil. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so uh, let me show you another uh, tiny box. But um, look how cute this is. Okay, this one also was from the same same place. Look at this, guys. It's brass. Uh, I think this is moss agate. I'm not sure. It looks kind of like moss agate. I still need to test it. But look how beautiful this is. It's on brass. It needs a little bit of polishing, but oh my God, I'm in love. Look at that. So, so nice. Just the design is so beautiful. And that large, beautiful stone. And oh, I love it. Okay. And then we have a couple of brooches here. Okay, this one. Over here is, let's see here. This, yeah, it's a riveted brooch. Oh, there's some string on here. Okay, look how pretty that is. And I don't know if you can see this, but let me see if I can zoom in. There, the beads are carved. Look at these, there's carvings. And it has a beautiful AB crystal. It's just amazing. I love this. Love, love, love. Okay, next. What did I do? Okay. <laughs> okay, the next one here. I also love, but it's broken, guys. Look how beautiful this is. It's missing um, the brooch. Yeah, it must have broke. But it is so beautiful. I'm going to keep this and maybe put it on a head barrette, a hair barrette, or um, use it for some kind, something craft. Because it's not missing anything, and it's beautiful crystals. It has the sawtooth um, um, bezel over there. It's so nice. So this is a keep. So cute. And then we have these. These are sterling drop earrings these need to be cleaned as well I might do the next video the cleaning video because I want to really want to use that ultrasonic machine okay we're gonna go through um, the box that we still haven't gone through and I'm also going to show you another item that I purchased it's a music box it's with city skaters on it it's so cute this is also sterling it's a heart with CZs I love the chain. You know how I'm into chains right now. <laughs> so yeah, we have those. Okay, those were the new new uh, finds. Now I'm gonna go through this box and see what we have left here. Okay, we have this one. Okay, let's see what this is. There's a tag. What does that say? Uh, Erickson Beeman. That is pretty very sparkly the colors are just fantastic very very nice have that one and we have this one i think we saw this one did i just take it out and put it back i'm not sure this one is Irwin pearl it's a chain uh, necklace okay uh, a brooch We did find some really nice items out of this lot in the previous video. We have a bird. It's a costume. Another one here. That feels so cold. I, I think that's a real stone, guys. Hang on. 
this feels really really cold but oh, the chain I don't think it's sterling or anything oh okay yeah it's just costume jewelry but my guess is this is a real stone it's really really cold I'm not sure what the stone is maybe um I don't know guys uh, crystal phrase I think it was called and then we have this one here it's a little clover mm, I think this one may be a stainless steel let me check the clasp yeah the clasp is a stainless steel clasp so it must be stainless steel or it might not you know sometimes they just put it on the chain but let's check and see if there's any marks no it's definitely what came with the chain okay the cute little clover next we have this one it's a black either it's glass or onyx i'm not sure we'll test and then it's on this chain here um the chain i think it's two there's two chains two chains uh, let's see if there's any writing on the chain i don't see anything no okay so there's two chains and then this really fun nice pendant and then we have these earrings clip-ons um i don't see anything but let me take a closer look no they're vintage clip-on earrings that kind of have little they look like shells a little bit okay next we have this one okay not sure what any of this is made of but i don't think this is bakelite or amber or anything okay that aside next we have this it's a ship crystal harmony it says okay oh must be like a souvenir okay uh, these i really like look at this i love these i don't know why <laughs> i think they're really cool they're little drop uh kind of like pearls i don't they're not real pearls uh, let's see if there's any marks or anything on, on this one no i don't oh hang on i see something nope they're just little scratches i thought it was a mark no i don't see anything but they're really cute i like these okay let me keep these then we have some earrings and rings let's take them out a pendant that's going to go into crafts somebody can make something with this one and i'll put the bird in crafts too oh a cameo ring that's really pretty uh it's an adjustable uh vintage cameo ring i'm checking to see if anything is missing and i don't see anything no it has a little because some color loss on the bottom was most likely plated and the plated plating is coming off because of wear okay let's see what else is in here let's just take this whole thing out <laughs> okay oh, what is that okay some vintage earrings here so 80s so 80s <laughs> I think I had these earrings in the 80s, something similar to them. <laughs> okay. 
if I there's another earring here. Okay. Wait a minute. Let's see. Let's open them. These, um, I don't know. I don't see anything on here. They're just little clip-ons. And we have praying hands. That is cute. I think that this is a glove clip where you hang it on, I think you hang it on your purse and then you use it to hold your gloves with. Uh, let me see if there's any mark on the, on the clasp. I don't see anything on there, but I'm pretty sure this is for gloves. What do you guys think? You guys think that, th is this for gloves or is it for something else? If it's for something else, please, uh, put it in, into the comments section. I get a lot of answers and a lot of people that are uh, that comment that know so much <laughs> uh, about some stuff that I that I have no idea. It, it's really really helpful, and I appreciate you guys. Wait, I thought this was the same one. No, it's not. <laughs> I was like, it has a matching ring, and it doesn't. And this is just a costume piece. Put that over here. I see a cross. Okay, we have a cross pendant. These two, I don't see a chain for that one. Oh, look at this. That is so pretty. I like this one. Oh my gosh. It has purple stones. Oh my god, I'm going to see if I can bring it closer so you can see how beautiful this is. Do you see it? It is so gorgeous and the back this is the back let me see if i can see anything <laughs> i keep putting my glasses back on and back off and back on <laughs> okay i hope you guys had a fun uh halloween yesterday a safe one not very many people came here just a few kids but it was pretty fun Okay, so I don't see any marks or anything on this one. It's just a vintage piece. Okay, oops. <laughs> now it fell. Okay. Mm. Okay, next. We have this one. This is also a costume piece, but it has a quartz in the center with a real, it's a real stone. I may lot up these, um, these pendants that have real stones, but are costume pieces. I think maybe I'm gonna do that. Oh, what are these? Um, this is so cute, look at that. Birds, enamel, cloisonne type. It's marked, are these Tory birch or laurel birch? They definitely are laurel birch and then it's, uh, there's a name on them. It says uh, Swal. I don't know, guys. I can't read it. I'll look them up, but they're really pretty and they're in really good condition. And they do go for high um, high prices, these um, Laurel Birch ones. What is this over here? When I see something like this, I always hope it's Swarovski. <laughs> Uh, it is not, but it's very pretty. It's X's. I don't see anything. It's full pearls. It's a beautiful bracelet. And then we have this. Um, do we have the other one? Yes, we do. Okay, so I thought it was amber, but it's really cold. It's either glass or some type of stone. Again, it's another vintage earring. And let's check the back. I don't see anything. Okay. So put these earrings together, just the vintage ones. Let's see what else we have. This is a necklace. Oh, that's pretty. With AB crystals. That is really pretty. Uh, there's no maker mark, but I like it. I like the drop dangle. Put that right over there. Okay. 
Now let's see what this is. These are some swirly uh, type earrings. Um, let's get a closer look. And I don't see anything on here. I always check the, the, the post and then also the back of the earring because sometimes they'll have marks there and sometimes they'll be very small so you really have to really look. Uh, I don't see anything but I will do I will check them again of course. Okay we have this one. Um, this is something back here. What does it say? Avon Disney. Disney? <laughs> Okay, so we have a vintage, uh, cute little Avon Disney bracelet here. Okay. We have a bracelet. I don't see anything back here. No. It's just a fun um, bracelet in gold tone. I see a beautiful ring. Look at this. That is so beautiful. Um, I don't see any marks, but this is really, really nice. Wow. You should see close how beautiful this is. But there's absolutely no marks on here. Maybe stainless steel. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. I wish that this was sterling. Look at guys. Look how beautiful this is. Isn't it gorgeous? I'm surprised there's no marks on this. Very pretty. Okay. Next, what else? Let's see what else we have. Um, here's a costume piece. It's a little ring. Put that aside. Another ring here. This also looks costume. Yes. Some stacker rings, I guess. Oh, here's another one. <laughs> wait a minute. There's so many of that same ring. Oh, wait a minute. I, are they... Maybe they're a set? No. They are not. Okay, so we have this one, this one, and then we have this one with the stars. But this one with the stars, let's see, might be marked. Mm, nope. No mark. Okay. So we have that one, this one, and the other one here. So three rings unmarked. Oh, four. <laughs> four rings. And this one, oh, this one is marked. Let's see. <laughs> okay, this one says 18K RGP and six and then the number sign. So this is gold plated, this one. Okay, so we found one nice one. <laughs> Even though it's small, but this one is plated. Okay. And then we have roses rose gold and yellow gold i'm gonna check and see if there's anything on this one that i can see yes it says cremens k-r-e-m-e-n-t-z cremens i'm very bad with the pronunciations so they're rose earrings with a screw back like so they're in very good condition. We'll put that. Oh, another ring, guys. Another ring. Oh. Um, I don't see anything on this one. And I do see somewhere over here. This one is definitely a costume piece. Sometimes they'll have a mark of a designer, like Guess or something like that. A department store brand, but I don't see that either. What is this one? This one, it says Coach. Coach, okay. 
Okay, so we have a coach necklace here with the little coach tag. It just needs a little bit of polish and it'll be good as new. We have a crown. Okay, and this one, that's a really nice crystal. Um, I'm not sure what this is. <laughs> okay. okay. Put that aside. Some more earrings. Messy, messy in here. Okay. Now, what is this over here? We have these little crystals and I'm going to check and see if there's any mark on and there is uh, let's see what this is uh, it says to 14 kgf so these are gold fill crystal earrings they're a gold color the beads are gold okay so we have that what is this one? Let me check the back. I don't see anything. They're drop full pearls, posts. Okay. We have this one. This looks like a ring that's also costume. Okay. We have this one here. Mm, let's see beautiful blue stones beautiful i think they're glass but they're so beautiful and let's check this one is a lever back okay i see something in the back but it's very hard to read let me check the other one yeah it's very difficult it might be gold plated or filled again let me show you these are really pretty too the blue and then we have a pearl ring oh i think that's an avon yes it is avon okay it's a vintage avon ring we have that what is this one this one is also pearls and there's little moons it's a clip-on now let's see if there's any maker marks that we can see they're so tiny too <laughs> no i don't see anything but they are cute little clip-ons i like the moons and then we have a little flower here this is costume and then we have this one uh there's scratches on the pearl but there's no mark or anything so we have these two i don't know if we have the matches oh we do have the match okay we do have the matches guys <laughs> okay we'll put that in crafts now what is this here <laughs> oh that's so cool it's a flower look how cute that is like a little bell kind of let me see if there's another one okay let's take this one out and do what's in here okay here's another earring watches watches oh i don't do well with watches i don't really like watches at all okay what is this there's a knot in it it's a single stone very pretty i love the chain on this that's pretty let's see if there's any mark on that one no i don't see anything on this no okay so it's a costume piece but i do like the chain it's very sparkly okay next we have this one here it's another costume piece this one is it's the charming charlie one okay 
and some more watches. <laughs> what is this one? Oh, it's a locket. Okay, we like lock. We like lockets. And it has a little chain over here. I mean, it has a little tag. I think it's Monet. Yes, Monet. Okay, so this one is a Monet a locket necklace. And there's nothing written on the locket. Let's see if there's a picture inside. Sometimes there'll be a picture inside. No, <laughs> it doesn't have a picture, but it's a little tiny locket. Lock okay, so we have a Monet locket and chain. More watches. This watch has a safety chain. <laughs> now let's see what this watch is. Okay. It's a Seiko. Guys, Seiko's expensive. I, I used to have a Seiko watch and I paid a lot of money for that Seiko. But um, I still probably have that watch somewhere in the house. Okay, it's a Seiko stainless steel. Um, base metal. Okay, it's gold tone. It's an older piece here. It's a woman's watch. Next, what is this over here? It's a heart charm. There's I'm trying to figure out if this is anything or not, or yeah, I don't see anything, guys. Okay, it's just a charm vintage. Um, well, it's not even vintage because it's a newer clasp, so there we go. Oh, little mouse, <laughs> it's a cute little mouse uh, brooch. And then a ring. Oh, that's a nice big chunky ring. Mm, I don't see anything. I think this is a costume piece as well. Let me double check. Yes. Also costume, but it's a nice big chunky ring. <laughs> okay, put that back. What is this one here? This also looks costume. Yeah. It's a toggle bracelet. Okay. But I'm okay because I did get a lot of beautiful items in the other, uh, in, in the previous video. And then I also got uh, some of the beautiful Tiffany's from there. Look, another rosary. A vintage rosary with beautiful pearls. They look like faux pearls, but... They're beautiful. It's a beautiful one. Yeah. Okay. I always find such really nice rosaries. Okay. This one is a bracelet. And yeah, it has a lot of wear on this. I don't see any marks or anything. I do see color loss. I do see the copper coming out from underneath. Put that there. Okay, we do have the other earring, guys. Oh, we have both earrings. Okay. These might be gold filled. Look at how beautiful the glass is on this one. Beautiful check glass. You can already tell from the way it's shaped. And let me check and see if somebody put these on nice post or not. And sometimes it won't say anything because the post, I mean the the, the hooks are also handmade, which I think this is the case over here. Yeah, they look like they've been hand done. Okay, so we have that. And then we have these cute little enamel fairy-like. They almost remind me of fairies. Aren't they cute? And these look like they're on uh, brass um, hooks here. Yeah, I think they're brass. Okay. We have those. And more watches. And then we have some bracelets. I see a bracelet here. These are just costume pieces. What is that? Is that a little perfume? Because sometimes these may be, might be Avon or Mary Kay. 
and you just got to check and see if they're marked. Okay, not, not that one. This one is a watch by a lot of charms on this one. Let's see what the watch is. It's Studio Time. We have that. Let's look at these other watches. Look at this one. <laughs> wow, it looks like a bubble underneath. And this one is, let's see, is it a Timex? Yes, Timex bubble. Uh, it says Timex Sea Cell, water resistant. It has such a thin band according to how, you know, the watch is. Very strange. Okay, next we have this one is by Folio. F O L I O. It's a folio watch. Okay, might as well go through them. What is this one here? This one, it says Nadia, N A D I A. This is a really pretty one. It has rhinestones on it. Oh, they're very pretty, the rhinestones. Okay, let me show you. They're beautiful. And it has looks like a mother of pearl face on that one. This is the back. So so far I like this one. <laughs> Next we have another Timex. It says Timex Electric. Oh, it has the little bubble in the back. I don't know what that is. Maybe the water resistant. Timex C cell. Okay, another one. Here's another watch here. Let's see. Geneva. We get a lot of those. We get a lot of those estate sales, yard sales, jewelry jars, a lot. Pulsar. I know that's another expensive brand. I know because I used to um, work at, at the Sears uh, Fine Jewelry Department. And I used to see a lot of watches there. Yeah, this one is Pulsar. This one's definitely a higher-end one. Okay, and then we have another one here. Let's check this one too. Another Timex. Is there a bubble in the back? No. <laughs> this one is just base metal uh, bezel stainless steel back. This one. I'll just put these in a lot because I don't know. I don't really do watches. This one says Regency. Regency. Let's see what it says in the back. Um, yeah, there's some numbers in the back. Mm -hmm. and this one, ESQ, it says. ESQ Swiss. Okay, that one. Okay, we have some more items in here. Let's get through these. Okay, we have this brooch. It's a vintage brooch. It's a leaf. We have some earrings. It's a star. Is there another one? Yes, there is. Okay. Oh, I don't see anything on this one, but they're cute. Dangle stars. And we'll put these in the cleaner too, just to see how well they clean. These ones are just charms. These are still the golf, golf charms. We had more golf charms. And we have this one. Oh, guys, this one. Um, yeah, I don't know if this is silver or not, because sometimes this kind here, you guys can see how the back is. Not all. Some of them that are made like this are not sterling. They, they're marked 925, but they're not. But the clasp, I mean, the, uh, the necklace might be. Let me check. Or it, I'm, I'm going to check all of it. It says J, and then there's like a symbol like T, kind of, and K. So um, this uh, necklace might be sterling. This one might might be sterling as well, but we don't know because there's a lot of fake ones that look like these. I hope it is but because it has a beautiful color stone, so we will check. Uh, we have another earring here. I can see if we have the other one. Here's another mouse. So we have two mouses. 
mice <laughs> mice <laughs> we have this this one i don't think no we have still more of the football charms okay we have these carved earrings i don't know what they're made of but we'll check sometimes they're actually amber there is a darker amber like this we'll check that one okay i see the other earring i wonder if this earring is a match to the necklace that we found no it's not because those ones were a b crystals this one is just white crystals and then we have this necklace uh no pendant but we did find pendants without necklaces it might be for one of them we have this bracelet little hearts and this one is a uh, it says something about sisters always sisters always there it says. okay we have a pearl necklace these are real pearls fresh water i could tell already by touching it and by the color it has a toggle clasp i'm not seeing anything on the toggle okay i'll reach i'll check the toggle again sometimes I, they're so small that you can't see them uh, we have a money clip okay and we have a bag here again <laughs> oh i hope these are sterling too yes i think they are we have the initial z like zebra and this one is 925 so we have that okay and we have another one is this one or two? One. I don't know what it's going on. I think it's two. Yes, this one's a bracelet. Let's make sure that this is silver. Yes, it says 925, but it doesn't have a, a pendant. And this one is a little tiny uh, bracelet. This one is also marked 925, but you guys, regardless of if they're marked or not, always check them. Okay. So we have these. We have three more silver items. And then we have these, the ball chains. They're kind of like a camel color. We have this one. I don't see any marks or anything on this one. We have this, and then there's some more here. There's one two oh wait a minute okay this one's attached here too so i think there's three of them there's three of them here they're kind of cool okay so we have three of those and these ones guys are agates but look they're broken see it's broken they need to be restrung so, um, and then there's another one here. Also, that, look at that. Yeah, so these need to be restrung. So what I'll do is I'll maybe offer it to somebody. And look, even this. So this one also, you could see the strings. Uh, these are garnets. But look how pretty they are. I don't know how to restring anything. So that i i'm not going to be able to do them so what i'll do is i'll maybe offer all of these to somebody and they can maybe make something beautiful out of them uh that's i think it uh and again my favorite of course is this beauty <laughs> oh it's not it i forgot to show you the music box guys hang on look at how cool. let me take it out first so i can show it to you guys okay there's a key <laughs> it is so adorable and i'm gonna keep this one because i don't have anything like this oh my gosh it's so hard to open okay so cool look at this isn't it adorable so
so cool so cool and it says music box city skaters um does it say what it's playing the music let me see if it says on the box no it doesn't say okay so let me show it one more time it's so cute okay let me see if i can get it to focus better so you guys can see how cute they are okay aren't they adorable so adorable <laughs> okay guys hope you guys had fun watching uh i will see you in the next video and i will see you actually in the next auction which will be tuesday and i have more stuff that i need to show you guys i have obviously have a lot more things that i've thrifted and picked up from uh, state sales and i picked up more more there's let, let's just say there's more <laughs> so we'll do a video soon hope you guys had fun watching let me know which one was your favorite and if you're new here please subscribe to get notified for more videos and if you're a subscriber thank you for watching goodbye everyone